The name, Orpheus, is believed to have pre-Greek origins, meaning it predates the Greek language itself. After Eurydice's death, it's said that Orpheus turned away from women, leading to his own tragic end. The actual box of Pandora was originally a jar in ancient texts. Pandora's name means all giving or all gifted. The Aeneid is unfinished. Virgil passed away before he could complete his edits. The Aeneid was almost destroyed by Virgil's own request, but Emperor Augustus intervened. Satyrs were exclusively male while nymphs were female. Nymphs could be associated with land, like dryads, sea, or even celestial bodies. Theseus is also known for navigating the labyrinth with the help of Ariadne's thread. The golden fleece that Jason sought was symbolic of royalty and divine authority. The agora wasn't just political but also a bustling marketplace. Roman forums were more organized and structured than the often chaotic Greek agoras. The term, tyrant, in ancient Greece did not have an inherently negative connotation initially. The Gracchi brothers were assassinated because of their reforms, showing the tension in Roman society. Helots outnumbered Spartans by about 7 to 1 at some points in history. The Flavian dynasty was responsible for building the Colosseum. The Antonine dynasty is sometimes called the Adoptive Emperors dynasty. The Macedonian War signaled the shift of power from the Hellenistic East to the Roman West. The Illyrian Wars solidified Rome's dominance over the Eastern Adriatic. The Delian League's treasury was moved to Athens, further asserting its control. Alaric, the Visigoth leader, famously sacked Rome in 410 AD. The Vandals, another barbarian group, gave rise to the term, Vandalism, after their sack of Rome. Mosaics could also be functional, serving as calendars or advertising public events. Original Olympic Games were religious events held in honor of Zeus. Slaves in Rome could hold property, which their masters technically owned. The Saturnalia festival in Rome turned societal norms upside down, with slaves being served by their masters. The color and decoration of Roman togas could indicate political allegiances. Early Greek coins often featured sea turtles, a symbol of trade and maritime power. The Via Egnatia was a major trade route connecting the Adriatic Sea to Byzantium. The Roman agricultural writer, Columella, wrote a 12-volume treatise on farming. Roman guilds, or collegia, could have religious, funerary, or trade-based purposes. The centesima rerum venalium was a sales tax in ancient Rome. The Antikythera mechanism is sometimes called the world's first computer due to its complex design. Roman concrete, or opus caementicium, was more durable than modern concrete. The Hippocratic Oath advises doctors to uphold specific ethical standards. The trireme was so named because of its three rows of oars. The ancient Greeks knew the earth was round, with Eratosthenes even estimating its circumference. Archimedes, from the Hellenistic period, famously exclaimed, Eureka! when discovering a principle of volume displacement. The Library of Alexandria was not the only library of its kind, but it was the most famous. The Romans innovated with the corvus, a bridge-like structure, during naval battles against Carthage. The Romans used the Julian calendar, which was later adjusted, leading to the modern Gregorian calendar. Pliny the Elder documented numerous aspects of daily life, including science and technology, in his natural history. The Persian Empire referred to the Greeks as Yauna. Some Greek city-states, like Thebes, sided with the Persians during invasions. Cyrus the Great respected Greek sanctuaries and offered gifts to Greek temples. The defeat of Macedon marked the end of the Hellenistic Age and the rise of Roman influence. King Perseus of Macedon was paraded in a Roman triumph after his defeat. Queen Tutor of the Illyrians was known to support piracy against Roman ships. The Illyrian Wars paved the way for the Roman conquest of Greece. The Visigoths initially entered the Roman Empire as refugees fleeing from the Huns.